to nine. All right, guys, what's going on? Scott Extreme, we are back with some more Dying Light 2 modded. Dying Light 2, yes, uh, for those that are new to the series, I, uh, I did 100% complete the game without mods. And to prove to you that I have mods, because some people don't believe me. There's a level four, you notice. I'm not taking any damage. Uh, zombies are one-hit kills, whatever. My weapon doesn't take damage. I'm level nine, by the way. And that was a level four zombie that you just seen. I'm going the wrong direction. I don't even know what my objective is. I'll try over taking over the VNC tower. I'm gonna just walk into this bitch like no tomorrow. I plan on walking in this bitch like my mama owns it. But if electricity really brightens the place up. But the fucking elevators are still stuck. Power's not getting to them, it seems. Now the building's been switched off for years, right? We need to check the electrical relays. Why ain't you a fucking bitch? The in the dark zone already working on it. They're trying to locate the power distribution room in the smaller tower connected to this one. And they're setting up the lamps you got us to secure the surrounding areas. When my men switch on the elevators, we just go up and... And now we move forward. This way, Aiden. Corridor B. I'm gonna... Not really. If I could survive a fucking nuclear apocalypse right now. Like I said, I'm gonna run in this bitch like I fucking own the place. I'm just gonna toss a bunch of these. Oh my god, the man can freak me out. Just throw these are on.
Let's get in and talk about some of these noise makers. I know what you're thinking. Why am I being a pussy even though I got mods? I might have mods, but I still like to use the equipment. Bro, I'm in the lobby. Roger that. Don't wait for me. The bastards cut me. Good. Yeah, I'm planning on waiting for you. Off. There's like 20 of them. I need to get back to the main hall. Make your way through the maintenance room to the basement. The power distribution room is down there. Oh, I forgot that only has limited reach. Shit. So, <clears throat> while I have this on, in my mind, Mike, you guys all know him. We have something special planned for you guys. Um, <clears throat> it's going to endure a lot of rage for us. 
And I'm in a lot of fucking rage. Boomstick. No, I'm gonna do this for. Ow, that hurt a lot. What it says on my dog tag. They got us. Damn volatiles. This is where my story ends, bro. Hey, man, don't talk like that. Is there any more survivors? Aren't you the blind optimist? Chris. <sighs> he punched through and went that way. The blackout. I think it was his doing. Get the power back. It's the only way to get the elevators working. The terminals are in the basement connecting both towers. Please, take this letter and give it to my wife. She's on the ship. Yeah. Bro. Oh shit, I forgot to go over here first. Damn it, why do I not have throwing knives? Like, ever when I need them. Banned. Oh, that only did half your health. Fuck out of here. Rogue Sorry about here. that. The power won't come back on. Shit. You'll have to check fuses. Fuck out of here.
Well, I think I restored the power. Get the cable from the power distribution room and get out of there. This had better work. I gotta go in here first and uh, open this door. Or else I ain't ever making it. So, you always want to make sure that you uh, get that door open. Or else you'll just have to go All and right. get that gable open. Alright, I did it. Ever gotten a medal, Pilgrim? Never. I'll cut you one out of a potato. We're going up to set up a temporary camp. See you on the eighth floor. Over here. Where's Leon? I'm oh, sorry, Ro. He, he didn't stand a chance. I knew it was a fucked up idea to come here. I got something for you. Thanks for what you did for my boys. I, I know you really tried to help them. What is this? A proximity tool. The GRE tagged more important goods with special RF markers. This might come in handy. Once all the antennas are working, you can use it to detect important containers and stuff. Lord knows what's waiting for us once we actually get to the roof. But you won't be alone. You'll have my men with you. And Lieutenant Rowe himself. You're coming? I've had enough of leading from the back and hearing my people die. All right, let's go then. We're waiting for Matt. He's bringing the transmitter and he'll oversee the operation from here. So, you have some time for a nap or to take a dump. Just somewhere outside the camp, pretty please. Hey, 
Mind if I join you? Be our guest. How are you feeling about the mission, Aiden? Well, we made it this far, didn't we? We'll see it through. Or die trying, right? <laughs> Oh, sure is a hard ass. Of course he is. You know his story, right? You've seen the burns on his face and neck. I was there when he barged into a burning dark zone just to pull out one private. Yeah, the guy can be harsh, but... Not a lot of people will lay it on the line like he has. Damn right. Okay. Time to get some shut-eye. Just a moment, gents. Special treat for the night. Well, you rock, Lieutenant. Here's to our fallen comrades. To the fallen. And pretty ladies. Why do you want to exclude your wife? <laughs> <laughs> Hang it in there, guys. We are, Lieutenant. We've been through worse, right? Remember the volatiles in the old port? Well, that was a carnage. It was, and we pulled through. We'll have another good story to tell our families. Am I right? You are, sir. Something's bothering me, Aiden. The renegades. And what about them? They're everywhere. Spreading in the city like cockroaches. But here... The biggest antenna in the city, strategic place, and no renegades at all. Ah, it's not like anything else they're doing makes sense. Good point. First, someone turned on the electricity. No idea why. And then, when I questioned a renegade officer, he babbled something about DRE facilities they're trying to locate. Didn't make much sense if you ask me. X-13 or something like that. But I'm worried what they're planning. All right. <sighs> Yo, Sleeping Beauty! Eight! The head honcho is here. Let's roll! Safe. Uh. Totally forgot where to go. Hello? There we go. Hey then. You're doing great so far. Yeah, we're trying. Right, Ralph? I've got good news for you. I've received intel on a certain GRE doctor. Who is it? Where? I still need time. You and the squad will go to the top of the tower and mount the transmitter. Roll will be with me down below. I'm going too. Roll, this again? Really? We have a plan. Fuck the plan. We don't know what's up there. I'm not sending my men up there alone. Fuck the plan? Not losing my squad again. You know I have to go. Just fucking come back. Yes, sir. If you need anything, you can reach me over the radio. I'm fine. Get to work. Sir, you all right? Go already. Want to hear a joke? No, where's Bowski? Fuck, please. I'm begging. I'll give you my last clean pair of undies if you spend another one on the jokes. Keep calm, gentlemen. Oh. Where's Bowski? Fuck. Sorry, boss. Won't say it, Pete. You're off key, dumbass. It went like this. Whoa. Commander, sir, what's going on? Elevator stopped. The power's unstable again. It's a huge building. We're on it. All right, boys. The repairs will take some time. We can't wait. It's footwork from here. What 
floor are you on? 30. So you got another 50 to the roof. Right, boys. You heard the commander. Open her up. Let's get hiking. Where's Balski? Recon. <sighs> Alright guys, I'm going to end of this video. I do resort to stretching my panties.